just women, little women, little women in general, right? I feel like, um, I feel like uh, if you're if you're present, just in general, I feel like um, that's what they need, right? So they won't end up on the pole and they won't do that. You know what I mean? Like, like I, I, I found what I do is say, like, I'll take them all to the park, right? Yeah. But not all of them want to be at the park. True. So we all go to the park regardless. But then I take a soccer ball for the little guy. I take a fucking whatever Christopher wants to do. Emma wants to, you know, uh, watch her little games or her little fucking YouTubes. And Eliana yeah. wants to do, you know, uh, whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah. Regardless, I think, regardless, we're together. Yes. And I get to touch a little bit of each of that, right? So I'll kick the ball with the little guy and yeah. then I'll go with Chrissy and, and Chrissy's drawing. So I'll say, oh, what are you drawing, dude? And he's like, oh, check it out, dad. He's fucking, you know, whatever. Yeah. And then Emma's like, I'll say, hey, give me your earbud in. And I'm listening to whatever she's listening to for a little bit. Yeah. And then me and me and Els will be, you know, do what me and Els do, you know? Man, it's tough out here, dude. And that, that's, that's his baby dad. No one said that. No one said it was going to be, you know, easy. But, man, it's hard when you have to pick between kids' activities. But like you yeah. said, you know, you take them to one place. They're all doing something together. But then they're going to do their own individual thing while they're there. But we're there together as a unit. And that's something that you are right. That is important. As long as I'm present for the babies and know I'm going to be there. Because I, I think I might be putting too much on it. You know Because so, I know living in the house is big. Omar, Omar even said so. Like, he misses me being in the house. And I'm like, dude, man, I wish there's something I could do about it. And if I go get an apartment right now for us, I would. So that's that's the goal. But it's no, really no, hard. No. It's really hard to split your time and your attention. It's just crazy. The one thing that um one thing that I do for my girls or I try to do uh is when whenever I'm with them, I treat them like I would want a, a boy or a man to treat them. So I open their door. Yes. Uh, I take them to dinner. I sit with them. I talk with them. You know, I, I, I ask them about their day. I date them. So right. they know what a real date is supposed to be about. Not this fucking, not this like, un, uh, you know, unlock the door with the clicker and let the girl go in by herself. Like, man, nah. please. Or the Netflix and chill. Like, now you going to talk to me. Nah, you know, we're Netflix talking. We're talking. We're getting <laughs> in. You're know me. My daddy got a gun. He ain't afraid of you. <laughs> no, but this is good stuff, bro. I said record just to get, like you said, some extra B-roll. Let's see what they do with that. 